a solid cylinder having radius of base as 21 cm and height as 16 cm is bisected from its height to get two identical cylinders. What will be the percentage increase in the total surface area? Here when you bisect, you are creating two additional bases. That is, here this is the cylinder and here you are bisecting it from the height to get two identical cylinders. That is, you are bisecting from middle point. Now you are creating two additional bases, one here and one here. That is, if you look at this, here you are creating one additional base and here also you are creating one additional base. So if you look at this, this is the base and area of these two bases is equal to pi r square plus pi r square. Area of this section is pi r square. Area of this space is also pi r square. So total 2 pi r square increment. So this 2 pi r square increment is from this initial total surface area. So total surface area of cylinder is equal to 2 pi r into r plus h. Now you can see 2 pi r and 2 pi r cancel remaining is r by r plus h. r is equal to 21 and height is equal to 16. So 21 plus 16 is 37 into 100. Now, 40 goes 5 times in 200. Then 37 goes 5 times in 210. If you look at this, option 1 is your answer. That is 56.76 percentage. Here, this total area, surface area means surface area of these two bases and covered surface area. When you bisect it, here these two bases are equal. These two bases are equal. And curved surface area is also equal. But you are creating two additional bases. Two additional bases. That's why increment is 2 pi r square. You don't need this diagram. When you bisect, you are creating two bases. Two bases area increment is 2 pi r square. Divided by initial surface area into 100.